All right, what is up, everybody? We're back again with another opening. And for this week, we have our final box of 2021 Panini Mosaic Basketball Team All. Still hoping to get a top rookie gold wave. And before we start, I just want to say Joker just had like 40, 27, and 10, a monster triple double. So if we can get him, I'll be satisfied as well. Um, not sure if he's in this product. I'm pretty sure he is. So I hope to get that, if not a big rookie. Without further ado, let's get started. Got all the packs out. Let's get started with the rip. And just go over some of the ongoings of the NBA and what happened the last week. Alright, first pack. Like I mentioned, Joker just had a monster game, so we hope to get him. But another player who had a monster week, but unfortunately, to no one's surprise, he's injured. AD. Uh, he's going to be out for a month, so it's really unfortunate. But hopefully Lakers uh, you know, do well without him. Now right, let's start Larry Nance Jr. Joe and Beef playing really well. We got Jermichael Green who is running on that second unit for the Warriors. Uh, they, fa they finally found some time for him at the center position and they killed us, the Raptors. The Raptors, they, they really need to find some identity, man, um, and figure it out. Anyways, for our first red wave, we did get Isaiah Joe who's actually on the OKC center right now. I believe he's getting some minutes and getting some good run for them. Over Trey Mann, actually, who recently got sent to the, uh, the G League. All right, so there we go. That's our first red wave. Second pack. Okay, okay. You know who actually also had a really good game recently? Kimba. Kimba is back on the Mavs. And with Luka sitting out, he dropped 30. It's always good to see Cardiac and Kimba balling out, man. He's one of my favorite players. Um, KCP, Keldon Johnson, taking 20 shots a game and just being very, very mid, to be honest. Jaden Smith, first rookie. Vernon Car Carey Jr., second rookie. And we got Aquaman, Steven Adams as our second wave. Uh, for the New Orleans uh, Pelicans. And I'm sure many of you know he's on the on the Grizzlies. I think the most recent Grizzly news is that John Moran got ejected for talking to a fan, which I found really, really weird. And then he FaceTimed her after, which was kind of funny. Isaiah Roby. LeBron James, who now has to carry that Lakers team with AD being out for a month. Julius Randle had a lot of good uh, games recently. Theo Maladon, and Otto Porter Jr. as our third red wave. Still injured for my Toronto Raptors. Maybe he'll get back on track soon and, you know, same with the Raptors. They really need to find their identity like I just mentioned. All right, next pack. Let's see who we got. Mo Mamba. Mo Bamba, sorry. Jared Culver, again, after I've been talking trash about him, and I think in one of the previous videos, he's been playing really, really well for the Hawks. Larry Legend, very nice. Xavier Tellman, the rookie. And Jermichael Green, another one of them, except for Team Red Wave. All right, next pack. If we can get it in this sleeve here. Here we go. In other news, I think the Nets today, after today's win, they're in... I don't know what place they're in, but they won 16 in a row. Kyrie finally settled in, looking like. Ben's playing well. KD's playing out of this world, as usual. Kyrie's Levert. DeMar DeRozan. I think they just had a blowout loss today against the Wolves and had a tough loss against uh, the Knicks as well recently. OG and Nobi currently injured. Hopefully he comes back soon for us. Anthony Edwards, amazing dunk against the Bulls. And I only know this and I remember because that game just happened. True rookie, very nice. Hits pile. And wow, this is our biggest hit probably so far. 
we got Red Wave rookie NBA debut of Tyrese Halliburton. Hooping for the Indiana Pacers. Man, they're they're going through a good rebuild, I think. Last pack on the left side. Oh, and I cannot open this one. Here we go. All right. Giannis. Bucks are still the top team, in my opinion. Lonzo Ball. Campazzo. A congratulations to Argentina for winning the World Cup. There we go. We got a mosaic silver of KD, one of the greatest scorers of all time. I'm going to sleeve him up. And we got John Wall, who is now playing for the Clippers. And speaking of on the Clippers, Kawhi is looking scary, guys. And he looks like he's back. Even though he's in limited minutes and not playing back-to-backs, he's looking real scary, man. Especially when with PGL, that game he had. I think he took like 26 shots, but... Just had a flurry uh, of buckets at the end to seal the deal for them in that win uh, this past weekend. All right, we got Zach Levine, Cam Reddish, and maybe he'll get traded again. Thomas Bryant, yo, he'd be flexing on them guys, man. The Wizards game, and he's in the Wizards uniform now, but in the Wizards game that just finished, he was hooping out. James Wiseman, recently recalled. I think he's handling it well, to be honest. Putting him in the hit spot. And here we go. What a great uh, box so far. We have a red wave of one of the greatest of all time. Finals MVPs, LeBron James. Hey, maybe he'll get another one this year. But, you know, it's kind of kind of highly unlikely. Especially now with AD being out. But still, still one of the greatest ever. So, Zion... Still playing well this week for the Pels, man. Okay, Kevin Durant. Steve Adams, we've seen some dupes now. Killian Hayes. <laughs> we're hitting him. Hey, we're happy now. Unfortunately for Kate, who's out the rest of the year, Killian's picking up some slack. He's playing really, really well. Again, hits power. In you go. Monte Morris, who's now playing for the, uh, the Withers. Go. Next pack. Actually, I'm surprised you see that we haven't gotten any Celtics cards yet or Celtics players yet. Because Tatum's playing like an MVP. That game against the Lakers, whoo! That boy's a bucket. And he's clutch too. Kelly O, Mason Plumley, National Pride of Chris Paul. Are they the most hated team, the Phoenix Suns? And hey, can't go wrong with the Hall of Famer and the logo, Red Wave, of Jerry West. There we go. Great card. Again, very, very good box so far. Next pack. Let's see if we can get a, a Tatum or Joker here. Probably some of the front runners for the MVP right now. Shamo, Troy Brown Jr., Josh Richardson. That Spurs team just. They're not good. They're in the Wimby uh, sweepstakes. Sweepstakes. Uh, uh, twisting my words here. Uh, Quickly, C.J. McCollum, again, playing for, as guess, the number one team right now in the West, the Pelicans. All right, we're down to two packs. We still haven't seen any gold waves, so hopefully they're in here, and hopefully at least one of them is a big rookie. All right. Again, these packs are just really hard to open. I'm trying to not spoil the back because usually the wave card is the last one, so... All right, Kobe White, starting off with that. Marvin Bagley. LeBron James. LeBron James. Tyrese Maxey. Again, hopefully he's coming back soon. And our first goal wave is not a rookie. For the Raptors, A hey, Kawhi Leonard. Just going straight to the PC. What a great card. Finals MVP, Kawhi Leonard, go to wave. I have the exact same shirt too. Man, even though a lot of Toronto fans still, you know, kind of wish he stayed, I think he did his job. And, uh, you know, I'm very thankful that he brought us a championship and that trade worked out for us. I was super, super 
mad about it, especially when they're trading someone who is, I believe, still a Raptors legend, uh, DeMar uh, DeRozan. He, he was probably the only guy, uh, superstar at the time, who re-signed with us in a long-term extension. So, forever Raptor, but grateful for Kawhi, man. Thank you for bringing us a chip. JV, Stephen Curry, I think he's going to be out a couple weeks. So he might not play in the Christmas game, but Jordan Poole is hooping out in, uh, in his place. Kyra Lewis Jr., CJ Ellaby, again, don't know where he is. I think he's in the G League. Next card, and just go away, but it's not a rookie for the Cavs. Ah, Colin Sexton with a giant print line right there. Uh, so he was playing really, really well before his injury for the Jazz. The Jazz team has settled down a bit, but, you know, I think they'll make a very interesting play-in uh, if they get that far later down the season. But I think they're on pace to do that, and it's it's going to be fun. You know, that's a young team, fun to watch. Kessler, uh, Walker, Walker Kessler, dude, he, he's looking good. I forgot his name. So excuse that, but Kessler's looking good, man. All right, here's our hits recap. We have CJ McCollum, the Red Wave. Jerry West, Monte, Kenny Hayes, there we go. Um, LeBron. We had a KD on the Mosaic Silver, not bad. John Wall Red Wave, Halliburton Red Wave, probably one of our best hits. Uh, Ant-Man Base, Jermichael Green, Otto Porter Jr., Aquaman, Isaiah Joe Red Wave, Colin Sexton Gold Wave, and I'm going to put him in the front. Fun guy, Kawhi Leonard. Hey, I think this is a really, really good box so far, man. I don't know if we made all of our money back, but fun rip. We got some good stars, good rookies. No big gold wave rookie, but we'll take those. It's been fun ripping all these four boxes. I'm going to try to continue this series on a weekly basis and just, you know, talk some hoops. And again, if you like any of the cards here, let me know which one. If you have any good takes about the NBA this week, let me know as well. Feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. Till next time. Peace, guys.